Hiya, it's Mano here. What is up, you guys? Sometime no see. Today, I want to speak to you guys about bugs. Yeah, I know, bugs are a common fear amongst many, but I'm not always afraid of them. Only when they do creepy things. You see, I can smash a roach if it's in a large space, but when it's in a close, small space, I can't really do that. All insects and arachnids have squashing rules in my book. For instance, spiders are fine as long as they're not huge and furry. I can deal with a spider two inches in circumference, max. Anything bigger must die. Bugs have a similar rule. The smaller, the less likely I am to freak you out. Yet, large beetles don't really scare me, but roaches? Roaches scare me. They always make a weird ticking sound when they're on the move, and it's just freaky. I'm not trying to die like a horror movie character in my own home. I'll tell you, once as a kid, I was sleeping in the middle of the night, I heard a ticking noise. I woke up and looked at the ceiling and saw a huge black blob. Once my eyes focused, I saw the roach. Never in my life did an escape seem so far away. They were so creepy. I remember coming back home from college. I was exhausted and just wanted to take a shower and sleep. I turned on my bathroom light and I saw one. A roach, about two inches long, just chilling on the shower curtain rod. I think I could have killed it, but how was I supposed to with that thin rod in the way? That roach would definitely do some maneuver and drop kick me in the face. You might think I'm crazy, but once, as a youngin', I attempted to smash a roach, and boy did it jump at me. Its wings expanded and I ran out there as fast as I could. But back to the curtain rod roach. So I yelled for my brother to help. He's like seven years younger than me and he wasn't going to even approach the bathroom knowing that there was a roach in there. The next bet was my mom. She walked over to see and when she got a glimpse of the size of that thing, you should have seen her eyes. She was like, you're on your own. I began contemplating my need to shower. The last resort was my father. He has no fears of insects. I called him and he came over all nonchalantly and asked me why I didn't spray it. Well, I didn't want that thing to come at me, so I just told him I didn't know I could do that. So my dad got the spray bottle and gave the roach, say, Billy the Roach, a puff of death. Billy wiggled on the rod a bit and then began to panic. He was freaking out! So much so, he lunged at my dad. I'm not kidding, that roach freaking flew on my dad's shirt and fell down his leg. Billy then tried one last act of revenge and tried to climb onto my dad. He spun around his leg so fast that I freaked out. My dad just stood there like it was normal, but I ran laughing hysterically, both in amazement of the speed of little Billy and because of my dad's careless face. Billy rested in peace as we flushed him down the toilet. But yeah, cockroaches are not cool. Ugh, bugs. Let me know any crazy insect stories you guys have in the comment section below. I'm serious, I want to hear some hardcore insect survival stories. Well, this is Manual Shark signing out. Hurrah!